As millions of Texas children are back in school, the Texas Department of Transportation is reminding drivers to stay focused and drive safe in and around school zones. And this includes adhering to a new Texas law that requires drivers to stop and yield to pedestrians in crosswalks. Here with some tips, TxDOT's Jennifer Wright. Hi, Jennifer. Hi, Mark. It is up to all of us to keep our children safe on their way to and from school. And as you mentioned, I do have some tips. Well, I would imagine you do. First of all, what about drivers who are not parents that are dropping off students? Well, uh, drivers should be aware that traffic patterns around schools may have changed since last year. And we need to slow down and pay attention to that. And that means put your phone away and be on the lookout for people ready to cross the street. And remember, you do have to come to a complete stop for pedestrians in a crosswalk. And school zones are no passing zones. If you move to pass a stopped or slowing car, you may not be seeing the reason they're stopping or slowing, which could obviously be someone in the crosswalk. So obey the reduced speed limit. And remember, traffic fines increase in school zones. All right. So what about if you're picking up or dropping off kids if you're a driver? Well, that means you're really getting close to the school to pick up or drop off. And so again, be aware, traffic patterns for pickups and drop offs may have changed since last year. Be sure you're adhering to your school's designated areas and never, never stop in the middle of the street. Watch out for children who may dart across the street or from out between vehicles. And stay alert and, again, put your phone away. Remember, using a handheld electronic device while driving in an active school zone is against the law. Jennifer, as always, that's good advice. Let's talk about what's happening next week in traffic. While the I-10 widening west work is mostly happening behind the barriers they set, there will be a lane reduction of both I-10 east and I-10 west from Artcraft to Montoya eastbound and Artcraft to Trade Center westbound during the day, Monday and Tuesday, starting at 9 a.m. to restripe the ramps. Monday night at 9, I-10 East will be completely closed at Trans Mountain to relocate some safety barriers. Spall repair will close alternate lanes on I-10 West again overnight Monday through Thursday from Geronimo to Copia, while maintenance will close Loop 375 East and West at Trans Mountain and I-10 Tuesday night, sending you on some pretty long detours. Okay, as always, pack your patience. Jennifer Wright with TxDOT, thank you as always. Thank you, Mark.